Breaking news, according to my source, a package has been denied by WB Discovery that was requested by Ed Boon. Now, Ed Boon wanted to bring a surprise combat pack 3 to Mortal Kombat Ultimate 11 with the movie skins of the characters for the 30th anniversary and it was completely shot down by WB. WB said that they wanted to have a fresh face full focus on the next Mortal Kombat game as well as the Mortal Kombat 30th anniversary. So I just want to take a few couple of seconds to say thank you Ed Boon for attempting to get us a Mortal Kombat Combat Pack 3 as far as having the, the skins for the characters. I think that would have been super dope or I should say a skin pack. I'll say this much, a skin pack. So Combat Pack 3 would be actual characters. So let me correct myself. A skin pack, that would have been fantastic for Mortal Kombat 11, but it's looking like that's not going to happen. Now you're probably wondering why that's not going to happen. Well, my source informed me that they do not want to set the expectations that they're going to be doing things like that in the future as far as closing games and then reopen them because then the fans will expect if it's been done once it needs to be done twice and i'm also told that they're trying to right a wrong now the wrong that needs to be righted is the fact that they put melina and mortal kombat 11 because of high fan demand now a lot of you probably will be like high fan demand is awesome that means we want something and if you give it to us you're going to get your roi which is return on investment and i would say you're absolutely true about that however now that you set the president of giving the fans exactly what they want it bothers continuity issues with the video game's storyline and things of that nature meaning that if fans want melina to be in mortal kombat 12 they're going to get her to trend and more than likely get melina in mortal kombat 12. now a lot of you probably like dude that's not a bad thing well i'll tell you when it's a bad thing because then people will expect melina to be in every mortal kombat game now the argument can be made that mortal kombat should not be taking characters out the game to begin with I'm all for that because my favorite character should be in every Mortal Kombat game the way, same way Sub-Zero and Scorpion is or Raiden and Liu Kang. So that is a legitimate argument. However, Ed Boon do this intentionally to keep the franchise fresh and to keep the franchise at the forefront because if you just want to play those older games, you can play them. Ed Boon does not want Mortal Kombat to become a repetitive game like a Street Fighter or like one of the other games where there's majority of the same characters. So that's honorable. I can respect that as far as what's going on in that situation. But I'm just here to tell you this right now that we're going to have a good year. We're going to have a good year as far as getting information. Now, when are you expecting to see Mortal Kombat? You ain't going to see Mortal Kombat until 2024. It's probably at the least where you're going to see an actual game. But I can tell you there will be some type of Mortal Kombat 12 information given out this year. But you probably won't get it. Now, I was told that oh let me correct myself when i say you probably won't get it you won't get the mortal kombat physical copy this year so i was told that there was a release date of april 2023 for the mortal kombat game but now i'm starting to hear reports of 2024 due to some complications that they're having now i don't think they're going to make us wait that long at all unless they release another title in between which i am looking into to gather more information because nrs is working on that um that uh what you what you want to call it it's another superhero title that they're working on and that's what we just may be getting between injustice 3 and mk versus dc2 as well as an unannounced marvel project so hopefully we don't get any of those things and hopefully we continue with mortal kombat because that's what the fans want but don't worry i'm most certainly going to be keeping you updated here on the channel but as far as the skin pack that we were supposed to be getting it's looking like that's not going to happen due to wb shooting it down and uh just not going for i mean they wb do have legitimate concerns because they like yo the game is finished 
leave it alone because if you open it back up people who's going to want it to remain open and then we're going to have to provide more support people are going to complain and they don't want to take away any of the hype or the momentum that's leading into mortal kombat 12 so that's understandable too i see where they're coming from on that on that uh on that forefront now a lot of us would appreciate a movie pack scan but then you'll have people complaining combat pack 3 where's combat pack 3 and if they put new characters into mortal kombat 11 it kind of takes away the freshness of those characters being in mortal kombat 12 as far as 30th anniversary concerns and the new mortal kombat concerns so i want to pass this question off to you guys in the comment section below do you think wb discovery was correct for shooting down the skin pack or should they have given us the skin pack like give me your full detailed description in the comment section below because i think ignoring um the skin pack in my opinion was a great idea i would have loved to get in the kano skin pack or something like that or i should say the entire mortal kombat reboot uh film skin pack i would have loved it but from a business standpoint i understand exactly where they're coming from so again shout out to nrs man they they doing their thing over there and wb are some wb discovery and they seem to be handling everything correctly out the gate as far as these intellectual properties so my money's with wb and um i know they got our best interest and heart and the moment they take our best interest out of out of character you best believe i'm going to be reporting on it so again appreciate you guys watching and stay tuned to the channel catch you in the next one